Hi guys, um, it's been ages since I've actually filmed anything or done any hauls. I've just been a bit busy um, with uni. Um, yeah, I've been very busy with uni and juggling four kids. It's not easy. So um, I just quickly went to Aldi and um, um, I've... Um, I've put it, um, I've, I've done a bit of a haul, um, I'm going to put the things away, so I decided, you know what, let me just let you guys know what I've got, and, um, yeah, <coughs> sorry, so, <coughs> got a bit of a sore throat, um, did a bit of a quick shop, so, um, I th it came to £67.15, so I just thought I'd quickly let you know, it's just more of a top-up, it wasn't, and things that I needed for the home, so, um, you know, you know how Aldi's second aisle really kills everybody and their um, bank account. So, yeah, that's why. Um, I just thought I could do a quick haul and we'll get back to it. Thank you. So, guys, um, I've just picked up this catalogue um, and I'm going to show you my haul. I just thought I'll flip it around so you can see what I've been up to. I've got my receipt, so then I'll let you guys know how much things are. First of all, let's have a look at my receipt. First of all... I decided, oh, um, I needed some uh, uh, runner for my kitchen. So I picked up these, and as you can tell, look at the 10 pounds. Um, pretty, I, I like it when it, like, it says hard wearing surface and the fact that, um, you know, um, it's good you know, when it says dirt resistant, especially when you've got four children. Um, so these are two, so that, that's t 20 pounds for both of them. Um, and then um, I decided to, I've got um, table and chairs in the garden and um, they're really good condition. Um, just, I suppose you can, I wanted to spruce them up over the Easter holidays. So um, I picked this one up um, on Metal Paint. I've used the, their, um, if you see on my channel, um, when I'm um, doing a lot of DIY with furniture and stuff, I normally do use their paint and they, I recommend the paint to be fair. But um, so I painted this one, I, I saw this one and it's um, slate grey and I picked up two because I wasn't sure how much I would need. Um, yeah, I, do, I, wouldn't, I wasn't sure how much I would need. So these were, let's have a look. So these were, um, trying to find the paint. All oh, right, really, four ninety nine. Okay, so they're four ninety nine each. I just picked them up because I was thinking. I mean, if if it's not broken, you can fix it, right? So that was the thing. Right, I think that's the only thing. I think the rest is food related. Yes, it's food related. So let's just go down. Right, so in this bag, I picked up some Easter eggs for the children. Um, I've got four boys, so these were a pound each, so, you know, cheap as chips, fantastic. So it's four, so there's one, two, so that's two. Oh, and um, I decided to get something for myself too, as a treat, because, you know, mummies need some treats too. So there's four um, cream eggs, the children love it. I bought this one for myself. It's the Galaxy um, Enchanted. I think that was a bit more expensive. Um, yeah, that was two ninety nine. So the children's were one were a pound. Let's have a look at the goodies. I'll sort of that um, because I really could do with putting them away. I bought two of these. These are sweeteners that I normally use. Um, I normally don't have uh, sugar in my tea um, or coffee, but. Um, Sometimes, um, yeah, I need a bit of a sugar kick, so that's about, that's 55 pence each, so I bought two of them. Saves me um, going back out there. And then I also got some chewing gum now. Chewing gum, um, always in the car, in the handbag. A pound each, a pack of three. I know they kind of do the same in Poundland, so that's two of them. So that's that one bag done. Let's put that bag away. Let's go on to the second bag. Now the second bag, oops, second bag, I picked up salmon. Now my children love salmon. Now um, I normally do with like roast potatoes and um, some steamed veg on the side. Um, but 
as memory serves, I think that was 10 pounds. Yeah, it's one kg. Yeah, and um, that's how much it weighs. And um, yeah, I mean, like you've got instructions, 40 minutes. It's a quick meal, basically. Um, when I'm doing my uni, I can just quickly um, flavor this, foil it up. Um, I've got baby potatoes and put a bit of herb dressing on that and then um, steam some veg and, you know, kids are happy. So we've also got, because of obviously it's Easter, I haven't tried this yet. I tried the salted caramel, that was okay, as last year. I'm trying to be good, so um, when I saw the orange marks, I was thinking, you know what, that can't be that bad. So um, what I've done is um, um, I've got um, the rhubarb and custard, one of them. Um, let's see how the kids, how the kids eat that. I only bought one. Normally I would buy like different flavors and stuff, but because the kids aren't really that bothered. And then obviously, I love um, garlic's works with everything, you know? So I've got two of them. Um, anything, I mean, I don't mind putting on the salmon. So I bought this one. I don't know if what people think of this one, but this tomato, a mascarpone, like pasta sauce. I actually bought four. My children love these. Um, if you put it in with like long uh, spaghetti, and put a bit of this, a bit of Parmesan cheese, a bit of a salad, a quick salad. Kids love. See, I've got there's one there, two there, and one here. So I've got four. Um, and then uh, tonight I'm making um, chicken biryani, so we definitely need some mint for that, and um, um, some coriander for that. So I bought them, so they're going to go into that biryani. There's nothing else in there. And then I, I bought my own bag. So as everybody knows, I love my Harry Potter. So this has been well used, as you can tell. So I've got a fussy eater, my little one's fussy, the two year old's so fussy with his food. So um, I've um, got him this one, this um, layered cheese pasta salad. Let's see how he eats that. Let's have a look. Not really sure how he's gonna take. He's been really, he's two, you know, they always picky, aren't they? Um, then I bought these uh, pizza subs. I bought two of them. I was thinking when the kids come back from school, they can quickly grab one. It takes 20 minutes, you know. And then I've also, a couple more things. I've got this um, oops, apple pie dropping, okay. So um, apple pie, um, of, I'm thinking, now it's, it's supposed to be nice and uh, warm, but it's really cold outside, so. I'm thinking apple pie and custard. Not much because as I'm on a diet and it's red. So I'd rather have, couldn't find anything with green and orange. I think there was one. Um, and then um, my sandwich for lunch. So that's it, there's nothing else in there. And um, yeah, so that's um, that's all the haul guys. And um, that was about 67 pounds. And there was not much on there to be fair. Um, I've dropped a couple of things on the floor too, so um, yeah, that's me. I just thought I'd quickly show you guys the haul, and you you can see what I've got on there. Um, if anyone's interested, they ha in my local shop. They still had some um, Easter stuff, so I don't know if um, anyone's interested in that sort of thing before um, it's all gone, basically. So before it's all gone, and um, I think there was like. Um, there's um there was a Maltesers type one as well, so there was quite a lot. But for sixty seven pounds, I think the fact that I've got two of these, I needed for the house. I've got the metal paint as well. Can't really go wrong, can you? Um, and then some bits and pieces. It's not my main shop, but um, I know I could do a lot better um, if I wanted to um, budget. But um, yeah, it's Easter, kids. We've been through a lot of these, a year and a half now, nearly. Um, so, um, well, it's, yeah, it's just more of a treat for the children, so yeah. Anyway, I better put these all these things away and start cracking back onto my uh, dissertation. So I'll speak to you soon, guys. Um, take care and stay safe. Bye.